Happy Marketing Monday, everyone. Our annual market report is live and ready to share. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to distribute the report through email, social media, and more so that your sphere of influence can stay in the know. Okay, let's get started. So the first way I think is the best way to distribute the market report is going to be through the trends found within Moxie Impress. Um, so this is what the 30A trend looks like. The annual market report is right up top. And if you click on the link, it'll take you straight to the market report on your website. Um, this is also coupled with blogs, um, areas to search for homes, events, and branding for you. Um, we have a separate video on how to send out the newsletter that I will link in the comments, but this is the first and best way, I think, to send out the market report. So to find the market report, um, if you don't know, if you're on the homepage, just visit your website. Make sure to always have your name in front of the link. Um, you will visit resources, scroll down to market report, and you'll see it linked here. So the full market report is in a flip book. You can do full screen and flip through everything, um, but that's that. So if there's any other ways outside of this video that you want to share the market report, just using a link, even if it's a casual text message or drop it into an email, um, all you have to do is copy and paste the URL up at the top of the browser into whatever other platform it is that you're using. Um, today, I'm going to show you how to do this on Facebook, LinkedIn, and Instagram. So let's get started. So as you saw, I did a little right click, copy. And let's come over to Facebook. Skipped ahead here, but um, when you're on your news feed, you'll just click what's on your mind. You'll paste that link, let it load the preview here, and then remove it and write your own caption. So, well, no need for the all caps, but check out the market report, whatever it is that you would like to say here. Um, do that in your caption and post and you're ready to go. Um, another way to do this, it's the same way on LinkedIn. So come over to LinkedIn, start a post, paste your market report, let that link load the preview and then remove it and check out the market report below. Again, do what you'd like there and then post. Um, so those are two ways, quick and easy, from your desktop that you can share the market report. Okay, let's get started. First things first, you'll want to open up the Instagram app on your phone and then click the plus button in the top right to start a post. So you'll see here you can select one of the graphics to use um, showing the market report. Click next and then drop in a caption. So it says that the numbers are in. Take a deep dive into how the Emerald Coast real estate market fared during 2022 with a call to action um, to visit the link in bio. Josh did an amazing video on Linktree that we will also link below in the comments so y'all can learn how to do that as well. Um, but then include your hashtags and that is all you need for a caption on your post. So the next thing you'll move on to is going to be tagging people. So click tag people, search for a person. If you want to tag our company, that's Beach Properties FL. You can tag us and anyone else you'd like to tag. Then click done. And then you'll want to add a location. So I would do um, whichever location you have in the graphic. I chose Destin for this example. Um, there is also the share to Facebook option. Definitely have that checked on for any of your Instagram posts if you can, because it's super easy. Um, but that is pretty much it. That's how you share the market report as a post. And now we'll back up a couple steps to show you stories. So we're just going to discard this. And on the bottom, you'll see you can switch from post to story if you just drag that across. So I'm going to post, then story. And I'm just going to choose one of these graphics again for this example. You could also do an intro video, whatever that looks like for you. But I'm going to select a graphic and go ahead and zoom in on it to make it look a little more appealing. To get a little bit of the numbers in there, like a little teaser. Then click the smiley face up at the top to get to the link button you'll see in the middle of the screen. Click that, and then you're going to want to grab this link from your website 
Um, you can do this on your phone. Just make sure your name is in front of the link. And then you'll click the bars in the top right corner. Click site menu. Click resources and then the market report. So once you click here, we'll let that load. You'll scroll down, you'll see it's loading um, the digital version of the market report. And this can be viewed just like this. It can be viewed in full screen, which you'll see here once we um, again get it loaded up. It's loading. All right, so this can be viewed page by page in full screen option from this link. Um, but let's go ahead and get back to the link. So you will copy the URL right here, copy. Then you'll come over here to add link and paste that in. And then you're going to name the sticker just a more appealing title than what is um, the long URL here. So click to read the market report. We also have another video on how to do Instagram stories that will include as well. You'll click done and then you can move this sticker wherever you'd like on the graphic. And that's pretty much it. If there are any other features like music you want to add in, you can do that as well. But that is how to share the market report via Instagram stories and an Instagram post. I hope you found this video helpful. These tactics can be used for all of our market reports and really any of our resources on our website. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to marketing at BPFLA. See you next time.